This morning, we are catching up with one of our favorites, an actor who has been entertaining us for nearly three decades. You're a child actor. That's not You're a child actor. <laughs> That's uh, right. She's appeared, in, she's appeared <laughs> in huge hits. Like, you've got male opposite, of course, Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan. And she played a, an actress in Distress and Scream 3. Well, now Parker stars alongside Joaquin Phoenix in the new dark comedy, Bo is Afraid, about a man desperately trying to get home to his mother after she suffers a tragedy. Along the way, he reunites with his childhood sweetheart, Elaine, who is played by Parker. Take a look. I can't believe it's you. I can't believe it's you. Do I look different? You recognize me. I'm old now. You're the same? No, I'm not. You are? Well, you're the same too, except for your body and your face. <laughs> and Parker is here with us this morning. You could be a floor director. You're like, you know, yeah, I was into just it. running, yeah, you're running I the show out here. Of soap at CBS. So he was reminding me the guy back camera when they go three. Yes, Zach is <laughs> handsome on. enough to appear on a soap opera. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, now he's going to turn red. All right, let's get back to the movie. Um, I, w I would say it's a little challenging to explain. The, the premise behind the movie. Yeah. Um, how, how would you explain it? And like a fable. Oh, okay. Oh, a fable. Mm -hmm. oh that's it great. It's about, um, you know, it's not exactly reality. It's a movie that, um, you know, I think what Joaquin and what Ari Aster are both so brilliant mm -hmm. at doing is eliciting emotions that you don't quite understand. Mm. And our hero, played by Joaquin, is... Um, on a journey, you could say. I think mm -hmm. Ari described it as like a Jewish Lord of the Rings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but what, what he, they're so successful in doing is creating a world, right? Mm -hmm. And there's so much art in this movie, and it's so entertaining, and it's like a real, you know, Rubik's Cube of, of mm -hmm. whatever it means to you. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like That's It great. doesn't spell anything out, and mm -hmm. it, it, you can have your reaction to it. And so it was quite a world to enter into. I got two jobs at the same time. The like staircase, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was two that directors like? that are friends. Oh. So I met Antonio Campos, who did the, the staircase mm -hmm. show for HBO. Mm -hmm. and we shot, I think it was from June to November. Mm -hmm. And within weeks, I was talking to Ari Aster, but who directed Bo's Afraid. So doing these two, Freda Black and Elaine, and these, these dark women, mm -hmm. you know, kind of in these worlds. At the same time. Was, yeah. It's like, I, I describe acting like you're you're writing a book that no one else will see. Like, <laughs> it's just all, it's kind of physical, but it's mm. all on the inside, and mm -hmm. you can't really explain it, so you just have to see it and go like, oh, yeah, Staircase was, like, interesting. Mm -hmm. yeah. This movie really is, I think, if you know, one to return to yeah. and unravel and... Yeah. If acting is kind of like a book, some of your earlier chapters, like <laughs> like uh, you've got mail. What do, when you look back on that, what do you remember of that? Oh my God, my connection to Nora Ephron. I mean, she was <laughs> she was like one of my. I just loved her so much. I, I read all her books. She was a a big support of mine early on. I was in. Um, uh, Sleep is in Seattle, and then a show called Mixed Nuts, and she wrote me a card. You know? oh. oh, like you get cut out of movies, or mm -hmm. they don't because mm -hmm. you have to propel the story, right? Or it's on the cutting room floor. I didn't and even know that. I didn't think about me that. A beautiful, like, handwritten note saying, "I'm so sorry, but I think you're a gifted comedian, and I'll work with you again." And oh, well, because you got edited out of something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and then, wow. like, so I was working just down the the, the mm -hmm. block shootings. Um, you've got mail, mm -hmm. and Tom Hanks, like, I mean, it was like I could open up the window in Chelsea wow. and be like, am I needed yet? <laughs> and the first six, he's like, yeah, come on up. And Greg Kinnear came up to the apartment. Oh, my gosh. And he's like, what are we doing here? Like, I can't believe I'm in a movie with you and Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan. I'm like, that's pretty wild. I love you in... in what was it? I was going to say Top Soup, but it's... Talk, talk Soup. soup. Talk, talk Soup. Talk Soup. I remember that. Right. Like, yes. Came on E. I'm having a post-nasal allergy. <laughs> oh, please. Uh, Fine. March. Everybody. Yeah, everybody and that is, and it's yes. bad pollen season. You're not allowed. Yeah. Yes. I wore a, a turtleneck under the dress before I came here. <laughs> I just think like... But, yeah, it's... Um, yeah, it's, it's all good. good. You're such a treat. I know. Yeah. Well, you are too. Thank, thank you. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah. Parker, thank you. Yeah. Bo is Afraid is in theaters now.
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.